According to a news published on the Philippine News Agency website, July 25, 2019, the Navy of Philippines shown interest to purchase French Scorpion class submarines designed and manufactured by the company Naval Group. The Philippines Ministry of Defense is also looking into the proposals made by Russia, South Korea, Germany and France for the submarine acquisition program. On July 24, 2019, the Defense Secretary of Philippines, Delphin Lorenzana has announced during an interview with the Philippine News Agency, the Scorpion is one of the submarines being evaluated by the armed forces of our country. The Scorpion class submarine is a diesel-electric attack submarine jointly developed by the French Direction des Constructions Navales DCNS, and the Spanish company Navantia, and now by Naval Group. It features diesel propulsion and additional air independent propulsion AIP. The Scorpion submarines can undertake multifarious types of missions i.e. anti-surface warfare, anti-submarine warfare, intelligence gathering, mine laying, area surveillance, etc. The submarine is designed to operate in all theaters, with means provided to ensure interoperability with other components of a naval task force. It is a potent platform, marking a generational shift in submarine operations. The Scorpion class submarines have ensured superior stealth features such as advanced acoustic silencing techniques, low radiated noise levels, hydrodynamically optimized shape and the ability to launch a crippling attack on the enemy using precision guided weapons. The attack can be launched with both torpedoes and tube launched anti-ship missiles whilst underwater or on the surface. The stealth of this potent platform is enhanced by the special attention given to various signatures. These stealth features give it an invulnerability, unmatched by most submarines. The Scorpion class submarines are currently in service with Brazil, Chile, India, Malaysia, Norway, Poland, and Spain. The Scorpion diesel electric submarine manufactured by French defense contractor Naval Group, formerly DCNS, is appropriate for the Philippines' requirement. Its Scorpion diesel electric submarine is a very good sub, appropriate for our needs, Defense Secretary Delphin Lorenzana said in a message to the Philippine News Agency when asked for an update on the project late Monday. Lorenzana said he was able to get a first-hand look on the French-made submersible during his visit to France last week. He went there shortly after his trip to South Korea with President Rodrigo Duterte for the ASEAN Republic of Korea commemorative summit held November 24-26. Yes, we went to see the Scorpion, Lorenzana told PNA but did not give additional details. The DND chief arrived in the Philippines after his trip to France on Sunday night. Earlier, Lorenzana said the Scorpion is one of the submersibles being evaluated by the Philippine Navy PN for its planned submarine arm. The Scorpion class submarine features a diesel and additional air independent propulsion. It can be armed with a variety of mines, torpedoes, and missiles for a variety of missions. It also has a top speed of 20 knots. He added that should the PN submarine acquisition program pushed through, it will be acquired via government-to-government -government procurement. The submarine, if we finally decide to buy them, will be on a government-to-government -government procurement and under a loan so that we do not need a large upfront capital outlay, he said in an earlier interview. Aside from the French-made Scorpion, Lorenzana said the DND is looking at proposals made by Russia, South Korea, and Germany. Concerning the submarine topic, pierre Eric Pommelet spoke about both ongoing programs and export prospect. Amongst the well-advanced programs in Brazil, India and Australia, he talked about the selection process in the Netherlands. But according to Naval Group's CEO, it seems that the French company is also very active lately in the Philippines. Another country where we've been very active during the COVID crisis is the Philippines. The Philippines is looking for submarines to increase their naval capacities and create a new submarine force. We've kept in close touch with the Philippines authorities during the crisis. We'll see in the next weeks if this project moves forward. But of course, here again, Naval Group can demonstrate we've done it in Brazil, in India, we're doing it in Australia the capacity to transfer production. There have been rumors of a Philippine interest for the French Scorpion submarine for about a year now. Manila is indeed interested in developing its own submarine forces. A small force of conventional submarines could then be a very efficient deterrence force against the other navies in the area. For a few years now, the Philippine Navy has to deal with historical submarine forces that are increasing their submarine fleet Indonesia, China, Japan, Singapore, as well as new submarine operators in Southeast Asia, Vietnam, Malaysia, Thailand. 
In order to protect its interests in South China Sea, the Philippine Navy is actively looking for two new generation submarines. In this respect, the French-designed Scorpion submarine appears to be the most serious contender, and the preferred solution for the Philippine Navy. The type is already operational in Malaysia and in India, where six Scorpion were locally built. But rumors had it that Russian and South Korean offers were also presented to the Philippine authorities. South Korean defense companies are already strategic suppliers of the Philippine Navy. During the press conference, Naval News asked if Naval Group is considering either local construction or local assembly if the Philippine Navy selected the Scorpion design. We are at the early phase of this project, with intense discussions with the Philippines government. We're exploring scenarios. We are not yet at defining what will be the final scenario out there. They want to create a submarine force, they are very interested by what we're doing in our capacities. We are then exploring different outlooks today, and I will not comment more than that. Quote.